Welcome back, farmers, and, oh, what did I run into? Um, we're here on the, um, the one server where I can actually be a realistic mechanic without screwing something up. So, what we're going to do today is, uh, I bought a truck that supposedly is exactly what I want. Not the truck, but what's on the trailer that the truck is pulling. Let's go, uh get down there with the with this tractor and the um the inter you know what no let's go look at it first so i make sure i'm getting myself so i can tell the guy i want a refund if i don't want it because i just bought it off marketplace there wasn't too good pictures or anything so we're gonna go down there and look at that today okay so uh, you know what? maybe i shouldn't take the service truck out of all the trucks i could take I should just grip and rip it with the F-250 because it's fun to drift around this curve but um now we'll just take this one okay so we're on our way to the local sawmill and they have this old dump truck that is sit here for I guess well there sit there for a long 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 time and um oh well that's a Ford I'm glad I'm glad it was a Ford that hit the sign and not some Chevy it would have probably broke the engine out of it but um they have a old dump truck here that has sit here for a long 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 time so we're gonna go pick that up but what's on the trailer is what i'm interested in where oh there there's a truck i think yeah that's our truck for sure um wow it looked a lot better on the pictures <laughs> The excavator looks good, though. I hate the doors have been open this long, but... Does this even shut? No, that doesn't shut. Um, let's look in the cab of this thing. Hmm. Doesn't look too good. Well, I mean... Like, I feel like there was a material or something ripped out of here. Uh, the pedals and everything, the seat, everything else looks fine, um, as far as that goes, but, I'll just hop right out of the truck here, um, yeah, let's, let's go get a truck that can tow this trailer, um, like this thing, you know why, that's, that's why right there, that little bow tie thing right there, <laughs> um, no, we need to probably get the truck unhooked and take it back first, so let's do that and then we can actually get the um the excavator and the uh and the uh the trailer back first i meant to say that the other way the trailer and the excavator i want i've been needing a mini excavator for a while in this series to pick up just random junk that i lay around my like car parts in to have that would be a great improvement because as if now we've just been using an old beat up hunk of junk little bobcat skid loader. I mean, it's not a hunk of junk, but it has way more hours than it's supposed to. And the forks are a little bent. You know, it's it's a that just proves it's a good one. But, you know, little Bob gets tired every once in a while. And Bob needs a friend. But, in all seriousness, an excavator would be the perfect machine to take an engine out of a vehicle. And that's what we're doing with it. Uh, we're doing a put a 6-7 power stroke in a uh, Toyota because that seems epic and uh, yeah let's do that um, we're gonna take that other truck so I'm gonna get this truck out of my way there we go I'm surprised I didn't hit the fence like normal let's go inside and see if there's anything else that Bob towed in nope that's the truck where we have the 6-7 power stroke for. I don't know where the engine is right now. We have it on order. But, um, that's going to be awesome. Okay, so let's pull this thing out. Of course, it's a Ford. It's reliable, so we'll start right up. We need to get that trailer out. I don't know what we're hitting. Okay, so while the ramps are just on 
we're just gonna get those to go down. We're gonna get this thing started. Now go, it runs. Let's back it on there. I don't feel like driving it. There we go. We're just going to leave this here. And if that trailer that the uh, other truck has, if it's any good at all, like that the trailer that the excavator's on, if the wood's not rotten and stuff, we will 100% try to haul it, that tractor back on that trailer. But if not, we can always take this F8, this F700 back there and uh, go get that. So that's the good thing about having options. One fails, you got another. I don't want to take these curves too fast with that trailer and tractor. <laughs> Hope y'all are having a good day. Man, I can't get used to this uh, six speed. I'm so used to driving a eight, an eighteen, and a ten. And we're off on our journey to pick up that old C70. I hope it fits on this trailer. <laughs> That'd be bad if it didn't. If not, uh, I guess I know where a Mack truck is when we are. Come around that guy. I mean, we cleared that guy just fine. We're just going to try to load it right here since I have a tractor that's powerful enough to actually pull it on there. Hopefully. The guy said it'll run for like a quarter of a minute. And then he said it just dies off. So I'm sure the truck's savable and stuff. But I really, I really could care less on saving the truck. Because one, it's a Chevy. That ain't how I roll. And uh, two... It's a sawmill truck. It's going to be wore out. It probably has a million miles as we're speaking. So let's get that trailer unhooked. We'll see if it starts. Come on. Okay, nothing more. I guess the battery's dead at this point. Uh, where's my tow? My tow. My tow hook. Can't just be hooking that to the empty frame, it'll fall off, you know. It's a Chevy, we can't be doing that to that poor Chevy now. There it is. Mint little tow hook. Whoa! I have no idea where that went. So we're just gonna spawn in another one from uh, Domino's Delivery. Hey, Domino's, I need a hot and fried uh, tow hook ASAP. Booyah. Domino's delivers. <laughs> okay, back to the main mission. <clears throat> now we know not to run with a tow hook. Running with scissors is one thing, but with a tow hook is a totally different story. How? How did I do that? Okay. Um. Okay, I'm guessing that tow hook is still hooked up. Okay, yeah, it's hooked up. Okay, so let's hook our cable. And just drag this thing out of our way. Oh, help if I wasn't hitting a car. I knew the old IMT had power. I don't know how much, but I know it has the power. I tried just to get them to keep the truck and let me have the excavator, but they wouldn't allow me. Man, that thing. I think the transmission's locked up or something, because it's out of gear. Well, 
right, if I do this, it just drags me to it. There's no way that's not pulling this thing. This is a four-wheel drive tractor. I think somebody left this thing in the cookie jar. Goodness. I think here we're starting to move just the fudge. I'm fat. Well, I have some. I have some. Uh, ether. In the truck. Let's see if that'll work. Wait, nope. It's, it's on the toolbox. Where's the toolbox? Oh, this trailer does not have toolbox. Right here. Okay. <laughs> we'll see if this thing will go long enough. Oh, I forgot to unhook it. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, run. Run for a second. I didn't check to see if it had oil or anything. Oh, no. Hey, we're going to make it. We're going to make it. Classic Chevy. <laughs> Come on, go, 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 go. Oh, this thing's just gonna barely fit on this trailer if it does. Oh, just bar barely. Now, if the ramps go up, I will be happy. This is my life. Ugh, well, we'll start it. Do what I didn't want to do. There we go. I didn't want to do this, but I knew if it come down to it, we would. <laughs> you know what? I actually realize it's stupid to do this, but you know what? It's fine. I'm junking the truck anyway, so it doesn't really, absolutely matter without it. it keeps falling off the trailer or something. I don't have to go up on this bank to get the thing. Oh no, we're gonna flip this thing. We're gonna flip this thing. We're gonna flip this thing. Hey, I didn't flip this thing. What do you know? And the excavator is gonna help us get this off, by the way, if y'all wonder. Just saying. The new excavator. We're not. Little Bob needs a break. Or I could just whip the truck like turn the steering wheel very very quickly one direction and make it fall off that would always work pretty good that's a classic one right there another one yes the best song ever our tra truck's kind of sliding a little bit if it falls off I really don't care Thank goodness that curve is kind of on our favor. At least so I thought. Yeah, I'm just gonna whip this thing off the trailer. If it rolls, I really don't care, like I said. We just have a C70 sitting at the bottom of our driveway. There we go, I did it. Okay, we're just gonna leave that tangled up. I think I hit the building a little bit. Whoops. Well, okay, let's take. What am I hitting? Like an invisible barrier. Oh, yeah, it's that stupid mod. Anyway, let's take this and go get that truck. Truck. Thank you. I ain't gonna turn off the music so y'all can hear this thing purr. It isn't that loud, but it's the best truck that has ever lived. 
This truck will drift so good you don't even know. Oh, it ain't feeling like drifting today, I guess. I love this truck, though. We're Fords. We don't need roads. Oh, I hit a car. I'm going to turn off traffic for the sake of the AI's life. But, y'all, FS22. I'm doing all I can to get it. Walmart is being stupid with me. Uh, I have it on order. It's just not working. But, uh, it'll get here one day. Don't worry. Till then, you got good old FS19. Oh. Oh, there's another Chevy over there. Oh, I didn't realize that. Huh. Looky there. Chevy. Shame. Let's go. Oh. Oh, well, that's a lot of weight. Oh, that would be why. Trailer isn't really made for this truck. Like I said, we don't need roads. Chevy, find new roads so the tow truck driver can be amazed. How far you made it. But then again, don't don't do that because then the tow truck drivers just don't have to, you know, go up another road. Give the tow truck drivers a break, man. I, it's not my driving, it's this trailer's screwed up. I guess sitting 20 years doesn't help it much. Oh! It's a Ford. It's a... Whatever brand that excavator is. Poland? Pelican. I'm calling it a Pelican. Oh yeah, and that stupid mod. Place anywhere mod puts like an invisible barrier. I swear it does. Anyway, if, if y'all enjoyed the video, please smack that like button. If you're new here, subscribe. FS22 is coming soon, of course. See y'all in the next one.